so I'm on my way out of uh, Max Urich cabin and um, it's at 9 o'clock I'm going to head out now it's about 24 miles and basically one giant climb today so just heading out from Max Ulrich it's incredibly beautiful here with the snow on the trees, um, on the pines. I got a lot of miles to do today, so I gotta get moving. Um, there were about five or 10 minutes before I left, there were a bunch of guys who showed up who um, were Ukrainian, and they, um, one of them had an AR-15, so they were like taking target practice across the meadow. I I'm not gonna tell a bunch of Intoxicated guys who were intoxicated at ten o'clock. They weren't. They weren't really drunk, but they but they had some beer. They were up having a good time. Um, they were nice. They gave me some sausage. I got some some like kielbasa, some like onions and stuff like that just for a little little snack. But um, kind of kind of interesting. So I was right about to leave when they showed up. I was just about to like sip my chamomile tea. Instead, I've got these very boisterous guys, big guys too, you know, <laughs> taking target practice <laughs> and uh, jumping around and stuff. So, an interesting morning. The weather's a little better today, so I can kind of document some of the tracks that I've seen. These, I think, are a coyote or a wolf. That could, that could be a, I don't know if that's a cat. It's very wise. A wolverine or something? That's a rabbit. What's no shoe here? Yeah, that there, that's a good one. That's kind of a big track there. You can see the top of my foot. I don't know what that is. I, think that, I don't know if that's a wolf, I think that's a cat. Or it could be just running, I don't know. No, it's bobcat. It's really fun to just look at the tracks. See the snow line over there. I'm not sure if I came through there. I don't think I did, but beautiful morning, beautiful day. Doesn't look like it's gonna cloud back up, which I'm so so happy about so this is just what it's been like i just follow game tracks miles and miles it's like it's like kind of like watching tv i mean maybe a lot less interesting but i try to imagine what these guys are doing out here. You'll see sometimes the tracks get really, there's like a ton of them coming in from the sides. I think these are coyotes. There was a very large print that I think was either a mountain lion or a wolf. Really big. I took a picture of it. But anyway. Okay. And there's the radius over there. Okay.
right on the trail. Get it about knee deep. So I'm um, night hiking with the Chinook Pass on the ridge coming in and I'm so lucky the the elk and the deer are are out because they've basically trailblazed for me, at least through here. And this would be deep snow. This would be up to about my knee. Or yeah, just about ankles. But they've the elk herd is made a lot easier to hike through. I just wanted to make note of something. If you ever are out in the woods and it's uh, snowing, you gotta be really careful if you're trying to track people or follow humans back into town or something. You gotta be really careful that you actually are following humans because these tracks here look like people. Um, I know that they're elk. I just, just make your mind. So, so I've bailed out from the PCT. Um, I'm hiking down now to Crystal Mountain Ski Resort. Um, I this is another one of those uh, deeply, <laughs> deeply you know moving or whatever moments in my life. Uh, I had a really hard time um, getting getting anywhere on the mountain today, and it really kicked my ass. I mean, I was like, I'd say it was knee deep in sections, and I was down to maybe a half a mile an hour, um, and I was texting people to let them know that if I didn't get in touch with them by like noon tomorrow that I was in a lot of trouble. Because what I was afraid of was at various times tonight it snowed a little bit and if I were to get stuck up here in snow it's just going to make it basically even more impossible to get out of here. So I texted a friend of mine and um, who, who actually appears in some of my videos. I'm not going to tell you who, because um, I, I don't like in, invading other people's privacy. But um, he, um, right after I texted him, I was walking along, and I saw human footprints and poles. And um, I guess somebody hiked up from the ski area to the PCT. And it's the only person who hiked all the way up here, the only set of footprints I've seen. And so I just have been following him down this here. You can see it's like, it's just dark here. I mean, I don't know, you can't really pick up these trees here or anything. But, um, yeah, so I should be at Crystal Mountain Resort now. I'm off the PCT for now. We'll see how things go.